Hello and welcome to the Crafty Chess Player. We're we're going to do something a little bit different tonight. Uh, I'm not going to play chess. I'm instead going to solve chess puzzles on LeeChess.org, uh, which, as always, is the best website for playing chess online. Uh, but we're not going to play chess. Uh, something's come up and I can't do my usual stream tonight, but I can still slip this recording in, luckily. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to uh, solve some tactics puzzles instead. Um, I've always used to hate doing this. I've always found it really frustrating. Um, but then I read somewhere that if you find tactics puzzles fun, you're probably not doing them right anyway. Um, so we're going to try to solve these uh, for the next 30 minutes to an hour, roughly. Um, I did solve one already, just to test the layout. Um, as you can see, Stockfish has this blue arrow pointing up from my bishop to, uh, no, from white's bishop to the black knight, uh, like so. And that's just Stockfish's way of saying that's the best move in this position. That will not happen until I've successfully solved a puzzle or have failed to solve a puzzle. Um, and I also have uh, the rating here. That's my rating that I have highlighted. Um, by successfully solving this puzzle, my rating went up 13 points. Uh, the puzzle's rating is up here. Um, that is actually hidden, again, until you succeed or fail to solve the puzzle. Um, so with that, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is this... No, not that. Um, this diagonal from the Black Bishop which is protected by black's queen. So a couple of things come to mind here. I could play knight here to try to chase away this queen, but I think, you know, queen anywhere along this diagonal is going to put an end to that real quick. Um, and then we would just trade rooks, maybe? I don't know. But I don't like that idea. I don't think it's the answer. Um, I could take his rook, and that's check, so we can't take my queen right away. Uh... I don't know that that's the right answer, but let's try it. Okay. Uh, and then maybe I come here and do a fork. No, that was the wrong answer. Um, so you can see now that this puzzle's rated 1769, and I've lost 12 points for not solving it correctly. Uh, I can still continue to try to solve it, or I could just hit the view solution button, which is what I normally do, to be honest. Um, it's better to try to solve it. This was the answer all along. I see it now, because this queen's protected, so, like, we could trade queens, sure, if he wants to. Um, but that's not the best move there. I should have seen that. Ooh, so I like this. So, moving this bishop anywhere is check. I can move it here, I can move it here, I can move it here, I can move it here. It's all check. Uh, discovered check from the queen. Uh, I like the idea of moving it here. Because then it guards this square. And then that's checkmate. So I got it. You can also do puzzle themes, um, and I'll show those off in a few minutes. Um, let me just try to solve this puzzle. Um, so if I move here, it's check, and that puts a lot of pressure on the bishop. So that looks like a good move. But there's no time limit on these puzzles, so I could take a few minutes to see if there might be a better move. 
And I'm not seeing one offhand, so let's give it a try. No, that was wrong. Um, maybe I was supposed to move here? Okay, I was supposed to move there, but I don't know why at this point. I mean, okay, so sometimes this happens where I see the answer to the puzzle and I still don't understand why it's the answer to the puzzle, which is why I have Stockfish running at the end of each one, so it shows me how it might play out. Um, it says Bishop here is the best move. And now it's... Now it's saying pawn here, and then pawn takes. This happens less frequently where I don't understand why this is the answer to the puzzle. Um, so let's rewind a bit. This is this is the starting position for the puzzle. And I thought, oh, I, I know why this doesn't work. Because he could just move back, right? No. But he can defend the rook. And then it doesn't work out so well. I mean, that, that doesn't work out as well, I guess. But um, but you can actually go to puzzle themes if you want to look at something specific. Um, you can study different phases of the game: openings, queen end games, pawn end games, uh, bishop end games, middle games. You can look by specific opening, like the Sicilian, the Italian game, the Indian defense, the Scotch game. You can look at motifs, like double check, uh, attacking f2 or f7, pins, sacrifices. You can look at more advanced ones, uh, advanced tactics like defensive moves, intermezzos, uh, quiet moves. You can look at checkmate patterns, like mate 1, mate 2, Anastasia's mate, the Arabian mate. Special moves like castling, off passant, promotion and under promotion. Different goals, like checkmate, uh, getting an advantage, crushing. You can even search by puzzle length, like one-move puzzles, short puzzles, long puzzles. Um, and you can even look at puzzles from Master Games, Super GM Games. Um, just as an example, I'll pull up Interference, because it's one of my favorite ones to study. And each one of these puzzles is supposed to have an Interference move in it somewhere. Uh, and your job is to find it. Um, and it isn't necessarily going to be the first move. You might have to set up for it. But I'm seeing this, which, that interferes with the defense of the knight. But I don't know if that's what they're looking for. It does look like a good move. As it's a bishop fort protected by this rook. Let's give it a try. And then we take the knight, and that, that was an easy two points. Totally sure about this one, to tell you the truth. This is a fairly complex position. Like, if I take this pawn, he's probably just going to take my bishop. Don't want that. This looks nice, but the bishop isn't defended on this square, so... I could move up here to threaten the queen, but there's three different ways black can take that, and I, I don't see how that's to my benefit at all. Uh, so I really don't know what the answer to this one is. I'm going to hazard a guess. It's probably wrong. No, it wasn't wrong. Okay.
and taking the queen was the right answer there. Okay. I can live with that. I'm getting like two points of puzzle that I solve. I'm probably going to drop like 20 when I screw this up. Okay. So, in this situation where it isn't obvious to me what to do, although I saw this right away, um, but I, f I feel like I might have a checkmate if I look more closely, so I'm going to take a look at that before I say, oh, free queen. Um, but something I do, if I'm not immediately certain, is um, try to look at checks first and then captures and see what you might find that way. Um, yeah, this checks, and then king takes, and to me that just looks like it's obviously losing. Uh, and then I have a couple of queen checks available, but they, they don't look too great, if I'm being honest. Oh, wait. This one does. That one did. I thought the king might move and then, you know, take the rook and it's protected by the queen. Uh, but that doesn't work. But taking the queen was the wrong answer, which is really interesting. Oh. I think I see it. No, I was wrong. I thought maybe... Okay, that's why it doesn't work. Because the king can escape this way. Yeah, it dropped me eight points for missing that, too. Um, maybe I should take the rook? No, I shouldn't take the rook. Oh, queen here, maybe. There we go. And that's your interference move, because these rooks no longer defended each other. That makes sense. Um, I think I'm probably doing a bigger service to my game by just practicing everything. Um, so I will go back to that. But there's different ways to study puzzles as well. Um, there's Puzzle Storm, where you try to solve puzzles as quickly as possible. There is a time limit on this. Um, oh wow, that does not cooperate with my layout at all. Um... Wait a minute. Maybe it does. No, it, it doesn't. <laughs> All right. Um, so maybe we won't do that. Um, but let's, let's see if we can do Puzzle Streak, maybe. Okay, we can do Puzzle Streak. This cooperates a little bit better. Now, so you can see the puzzle's very low rated. Uh, that's not going to stay low rated for long. This gets tougher as you continue to solve puzzles. I normally jump to the next puzzle immediately, but I will turn that off for the moment just to see what that looks like. And you, the goal, as the name implies, is to try to get a streak of solving puzzles. The higher your streak, the better your score. Um, so you can uh, try to get as high as possible. Uh, I think yeah. okay. I just had to make sure that bishop was on the diagonal. I thought it was because it's like I think it is. But I'm not certain, but yeah, that's the answer to that one. You checkmate your opposing king. As you can see, this puzzle is a little more challenging. <clears throat> Still, should be easily doable for somebody at my rating, which is 1400. I think this is the answer right here. Easy. Like I say, they will get harder, and I will eventually screw this up. Probably on an easier puzzle than I should lose on, but we'll we'll give this a try at least until uh, until it uh, knocks me out here. Oh, I see the answer already. Okay. This looks like a good move. 
And then I like to deliver checkmate with that rook instead of the queen whenever I can. Anyone could checkmate with the queen, right? Uh, this one, I think the answer is pretty obvious. Uh, by taking out this bishop, the queen's undefended, and then you can take the queen. Because you deliver check, and away you go. See, now they're already in the 1100s, so... If you're struggling with the 900s, this will be problematic, but I see a free knight, so I'm going to take it. Okay. Not bad. You get to see some interesting checkmating patterns when you do these uh, puzzles, too. Or just some interesting tactics, like... I was going to say like that, but that wasn't the move I was expecting. I should have expected it. Oh, I know the next move. Oh, I thought I knew the next move. See, easier puzzle than I should have lost that on. I moved too quickly. Um, but that's just another way you can study on Lee Chess. Uh, I'm just going to go back to regular puzzles, though. And... There we go. Hmm. I mean, there's... I don't know what the answer is for this one. I, I can't even hazard a guess at this point. I see a couple of checks, and... They look like they just both lose to me. Maybe they don't, though. No. My thinking was, move the knight here, and then it's protected by this bishop. But apparently that's not the answer. Maybe I have to take one of these rooks first? No. Take the other one. And then take this pawn. That makes sense. Okay. At least I'm solving them. I'm slowly clobbering my rating down to as low as it'll go, but I'm solving them. Okay. So, I see something that's interesting. It is rook here. Um, and then if he... No, that doesn't work. I thought that was interesting. Never mind. I thought that was interesting. Um... Queen here threatening checkmate. Mm, but then work here solves that. I don't know. I can't think of anything else. So it turns out that was the right move. Hmm. So I saw this check immediately afterwards and I was trying to puzzle this out. No pun intended. Um... But then we just trade rooks, and then I take the rook back with check. And I really don't know how that's to White's benefit. Because this rook isn't very active to begin with. I feel like if I was White, I wouldn't be too worried. Oh, I see it now. Free rook. If I stare at it long enough, I might stumble upon the answer, right? Um, so one thing I see 
This bishop takes. And because of this pin, he can't just do pawn takes. And it, uh, hmm. I was about to say threatens M1, but it doesn't. But what if we go this way? That doesn't look so good. That really doesn't look good. I think that's the answer. That's totally the answer. So, Rook here, the Rook's protected, but then he can get the Knight. If I push this pawn, he can't just take the Knight. Hmm. So I'm kind of thinking that might be the answer. But I think I'd have to push the pawn first. And then maybe the king? Yes. And it's still not checkmate, because he can play here. But it that king's pretty boxed in. Like, where's he going to go? Okay. So, queen here would be checkmate if it wasn't for that. So, I kind of wonder... Uh, if I could move twice in a row, queen here would be checkmate, too. Also, this move by white seems weird, because that looks like it just loses a bishop. I think this is the answer? No, it's totally not the answer. Okay. Maybe this is the answer. No. No, okay. Ah, uh, wait. What about this? Okay. I don't really... Oh, hang on. Aha! Uh -huh. That's the answer. Yeah, I was never going to see that. <laughs> um, but that's why we're here. We're here to learn, right? Okay, so... I immediately see this check. And that would put pressure on the king to go here, because I think that's the only legal move. And I can't check with the bishop afterwards, much as I would love to do that. Hmm, what if I check here with the bishop? He'd still have to move here. And then maybe I could come in with the queen. Like so! In a real game, I'd flag out long before seeing most of this. Um, but I feel like when you study enough puzzles, that stops being the case after a while. There, this position's a bit complicated for me. Because do I take this knight... Do I do something else, like threaten the rook? Let's see, there's no good checks for white here. 
And that's the only capture I see that's not terrible. Uh, actually, no, that is terrible. Because if I take, then that just loses the rook. So I don't want to do that. I certainly don't want to take this with my rook. Because that just loses the rook. Maybe my original idea of threatening this rook here isn't such a bad one after all. I don't think it's the answer, but I can't see anything else offhand, so, yeah. I'm not surprised. I saw this and thought that was just terrible, but no. Oh, wait. No, that's obviously not the answer either, then. Okay. Because I can't imagine it's this. It is that. Okay. I'll I'll take the word of Stockfish for it, I guess. <laughs> I don't think analyzing that further is going to help me understand it better. Might be something I just have to come back to. Now, I've noticed this pawn here, and I just feel like that's part of the answer. I mean, do I take? No, maybe he's not part of the answer. Maybe he's just a distraction. I saw this move right away and thought that'd be great if it wasn't for this pawn here to defend. Maybe that is the answer, though. Ah, oh, so close. Uh Oh, hang on. Then I do that. And then it's checkmate. Okay, I should have seen that sooner. Alright. So I'm playing as black in this puzzle? No, I'm playing as white in this puzzle. Okay. Thought it was playing black in this puzzle. Again, there is a lot going on here. I think I see the answer, and I think it wins this bishop? Rook takes here. No. It doesn't necessarily win the bishop, though. So I was thinking rook takes here, but black's under no obligation to do that. Rook takes might still be the answer, though. No, actually. Because if I take, then he's just going to take my queen. Uh, I'm really uncertain about the answer. I almost wonder if it's a queen trade to start with. I don't think I'm going to see it without blowing it, so I'm just, yeah, I'm not surprised. This gives me some leeway to experiment, though, and see what the answer could be. It's queen takes rook. What makes that such a... Oh, okay. Oh. So the king can't go here. And these are all check. So that makes sense. Okay. That's a lot of pressure lined up on this king. 
I kind of just want to take this queen, and then then it's mate and one if he doesn't stop it. Take this pawn, rather. Take this queen. Yeah, I'll take this queen. I almost want to say bishop takes pawn. Because that's still going to cause a lot of problems for white. Yeah, that was the answer. And then I'm thinking discover check to take that pawn. Because discover check any other way, he could just take the pawn. So, yeah, okay. I actually got the answer right for once. Okay, so I saw this right away, and I saw this right away to check and defend it by the knight. Which I think might be the answer, because if I take, then he could take, yeah, no, I don't know if he'd take there. He'd have to take here, I guess. There are also these checks. Again, I don't know. I'm just hazarding a guess. Ha-ha! I figured it out. Alright, let's try this puzzle. Okay, so... I saw that, which is check. And then if king here... Then this would be a fork. But the king doesn't have to move there. He could move here or here. And yet I still have the feeling that check is the right move. Let's give it a try. Oh, that was the right move because of this fork, I think. Uh-huh. Be interesting if I actually got back above 1800. <laughs> See, I kind of want to push this pawn, and that denies that escape square, and then I can move the queen in. But that is not the answer. Mm. I don't think this is the answer. I, I feel like if I, you can hop back a couple of moves too. Okay. This could be the answer, but it isn't, I guess. Um, oh, pawn here. I really should have seen that. 
And then we skewer the king to get the queen. Makes sense now. This is an endgame puzzle, and I've never done well with endgame puzzles. Never in a million years. What if I just simply push that? It looks like a free knight. Okay. First thing I'm thinking is attack this queen here. But moving either of these rooks def undefends the other one. Like if I move this rook, he just takes with check. And if I move this rook, he just takes. That's probably not the right answer anyway. That check doesn't work because of that knight. And this check I don't think works because of the bishop. I could take that bishop. Hmm. I don't know if that would be very helpful though. There's this check, but that check block, I mean, that move blocks it, so that doesn't work. Uh, I think this is the right move. No, I thought it was, because if knight takes, no, right, if knight takes and that, okay. I think this is the right answer. That, oh, maybe this one. I knew it was the knight move. <laughs> and then here. Like, I saw the checkmate. I just didn't implement it properly. Okay. Not really sure what to do for this. Oh, now I do. Uh, that was easy once I saw it. <laughs> it's amazing how true that is for all puzzles. It's really easy once you see the solution. Honestly, I've been out of practice for this game for a good six weeks. This is easy too. I've been out of practice for this game for a good six weeks. And it shows. Because I feel like some of the stuff I would have seen that I'm missing now. Uh, hmm. My concern is that when I move this pawn off of this file that this lineup is going to kill me, because then any knight move he makes is going to be check. I kind of feel like the best move is to take his knight, and then his queen's under attack. And the rook is pinned. So let's do that. Okay, he saved both. But then, if I come up here with the rook, the queen is again attacked and the rook is defended.
the queen will have to move off of squares that protect the rook. Because they're all going to be under attack. So I think that's the next best move. It's not. Uh, then maybe I should just take the rook? Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Alright. I'm learning. It's it's a slow process, but I am learning. So again, I think removing the defender is the way to go here. Because if I take... No, he could just take with the queen. Maybe that's not the way to go. If I take this rook, it's check. And then he moves up here, and then I get this queen. I think that's the answer. And then it's two rooks versus a rook and a knight, which is pretty good odds for black in that game. So, this queen is no one protecting it, so that makes this knight pinned. Um, so if I decide to move that knight anyway, I need to be really careful about where I move it to. I could move the rook here. And then that could skewer that rook. Let's try that. Interesting. I I didn't think it would be queen takes here. I thought I thought white would move the queen out of uh, danger, but I guess not. I think I have to take the queen with the knight specific. I don't think there's any other way to take that queen. All right. I can live with that. Uh, this bishop. I s immediately saw that and wondered, why is that not checkmate? And it's this stupid bishop. Uh, although, I think I see the answer. Because queen here wins a pawn with check. And the only way to block is queen here, which would lose to, to the knight. So, king would have to move here. And I was thinking rook here, but that won't work. Uh... Oh, but knight here will work. So that's the answer. I had to say it, didn't I? <laughs> thought I had the answer. Uh... Oh, I can still win a bishop, though. I think. Or this knight. Yeah, okay. Alright, not as good as I had hoped, but not bad. Like, if I can win a bishop off of my opponent, I would much rather do that than, you know, blunder the game. This is an interesting looking position. I, ooh, hmm. I was almost going to go queen here for the check, and that really wouldn't work well. Um, again, it's an endgame puzzle. I've never been good at these. I think this is the answer? And then I just run with this pawn. <laughs> okay. Should have seen the evaluation, mate. It's 67 moves. <laughs> it pared that down to 25, but yeah. It, it should be Black's game at that point. Okay. 
Uh, oh, this is a nice song. I like this song. In fact, I'm going to see which one it is because I, I really want to come back to this song later at some point. If I could fi figure that out, that would be great. It's the 183rd song on the playlist. Um, I'll have to remember that, I guess. There's the playlist. Uh I'm not seeing anything better than this. I feel like that's not the answer, but I don't know what else to try. No, totally wasn't the answer. Uh, I know that's not the answer. Maybe I take the bishop? Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Okay. I should have seen that. Now, I always used to panic when I'd see a position like this. Like, oh no, the queen's under attack! What do I do? But now, I'm more like, the queen's under attack! Hmm. What do I do? I almost did this, thinking that queen takes here, and then this would be... Yeah, it's still the check, but... Uh, hmm. What do I do here? I take the rook. That's what I do here. Because then that's a discovered check, and then, you know, the queen dies afterwards. Either because she blocked the check, or she moved, the, or, or White moved the king, and then you just take. Again, another endgame puzzle, and I'm not great at these. There's so many checks to look at, too, and most of them are terrible. Most of them, you just lose the queen, no compensation. <laughs> uh, I almost feel like threatening the queen is the way to go. Let's try it? Nope. Well, let's try the one check that I saw that wasn't terrible. That's also not it. Oh, wait. I didn't look at this check. No. Uh, or this check, which is the answer. But how is it the answer? Do I move here? Okay, and then I take. But doesn't white have other options? Like, what happens if he moves here? Oh, and then I just take the rook. Okay. All right, that puzzle makes sense to me. Let's try this next one and see where it gets us. Immediately I see this. Um, I didn't see that so much. <laughs> I see this as well, which sets that up nicely, and it's protected by my queen there. 
So that just might lose a rook for possibly the knight. So let's. I think I take the queen, and then he makes off with the rook. I think. Yeah, because it's pretty even if I don't take the queen, so... Let's do that. <laughs> I think I see a free bishop. I thought I saw a free bishop. <laughs> oh, wait, that knight's still pinned, so I can still take the... I thought I could take the bishop. Oh, but it won't be pinned once I move the queen. Okay, that makes sense. Maybe I should just... No. Ah. <sighs> Oh, this is the answer. I've been sniped by enough bishops lately that I should have seen that. Okay. So, I mean, we see pawn takes bishop. Um, That knight looks like it's free. Threatening the rook, which is why he did that. I almost feel like I should take, and then I take the knight? Yes, okay. This one's challenging too. At least for now. Because there's nothing defending this queen, so if I move the knight, then my queen's history. I mean, I looked at this, but then that loses pretty quick. I looked at this, and the same thing. Like, it just doesn't work out well for black that I can see. I honestly don't see the answer to this at all. Probably what I would do in an actual game, and I—that's definitely not it. Is it a night move? Maybe no, at least not that night move. Wait, what about this? No, no. I think I have to have you solution. I'm not seeing it. Okay. Overthought that one, thinking there must be a quick answer to this. Uh, no, not always. <laughs> Right, so again, my queen is undefended. His is defended by the knight. So what if I take? That removes the defender. And then we could just trade queens. And if he just takes my rook, then I just take his queen. I think that's the answer. Yes. Ooh, so I immediately saw this move, which pins this night up uh, this night. Wow, we're already promoting them. They haven't moved. 
promotes this pawn to a knight here. No, it pins this pawn. Wow, wish I could talk to the king, so it can't just take. And it forks that rook, which is undefended. So I think that's the best move. And then I just take the rook if I can click on it. There we go. Okay. I am almost out of time, so I'm going to try to win one more puzzle before I go. There's no guarantee that I will actually get away with that, but we'll give it a try. Hmm. This is probably not the answer, but I'm not seeing much else. Because if if this rook comes off the back rank anywhere, like to here to maybe try to check that way, then he just... Wait, he can't checkmate right away. That might be the answer. Oh, that was... Oh, right. Ah, uh, I should have seen that. Again, I moved too quickly. It's my biggest downfall. Okay. So I'm seeing several things here. Like, I could take this. Yeah, and then he'd just take my queen. That doesn't work. I could take with the knight here. He takes my knight. And then I check him? Uh, I don't know that that works either. And I can't just pin him. Let's try it. I think we want to block? Because then the only other check you'd have with the queen is here, and that just loses. But we... Oh, we... No. Ah, oh, I should have seen that. That was an easy win until I blew it. <laughs> Alright, I got time to try one, maybe two more puzzles. So... Playing the black pieces here. Want to take that one? He just takes back. <clears throat> if I move here, though, I think that's a better play. I have to take at this point, I think. Yes! I can end on a victory! I can live with that! Um, so how many puzzles did I solve? I solved 34 puzzles uh, since the end of the last puzzle streak. And I don't think I did too badly. I did much better than normal, because I actually slowed down, took my time, tried explaining everything to anyone who was watching. Uh, I'm sure literally tens of people will uh, will now be a little more enlightened uh, to these puzzles um, since I decided to slow down and explain everything. If you made it this far in the video, kudos to you. You have more patience than I do, I think. Uh, I do want to thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like and subscribe and uh, hit, your, hit the, the comments down below. I would love to hear what you have to say. Do you like this video format? Should I do more of these? Should I be streaming these? Let me know. I would love to hear that. 
And if you have any other suggestions, I'm open to them. Uh, thank you so much for watching, though. Have a great day, everyone. Thanks. Bye.